Wagon people, you don't know it's about Commander Brown, and today we're going to be speaking about a simple trick for you to convert photographs taken by your iPhone to JPEG so that you can use it anywhere else on any other device. Whether it's an Android device, a PC, a Mac, another iPhone, a tablet, wherever you so choose or desire, or even if you want to edit the photographs. Now getting straight into it, jumping into my gallery here, I have two photographs. Here is one, it's in HEIF format as you can see. Same for this other image, HEIF. Now what HEIF stands for is High Efficiency Image File Format, which as this says, is a container format for storing individual digital images and image sequences. In other words, it is the standard compression format that Apple uses for their photographs so that they take up as little space as possible by retaining as much of the image quality as possible. So going back to the gallery here, I'm going to now press select, select these two images that are currently in the HEIF standard format as I told you. I'm going to press the share button and I'm going to press copy photos. This is very important, copy photos. Don't press anything else. Now I'm going over into the files app now, right? There we go. I've already created a test folder here. It's easy to create a folder by the way, just hold on in a blank area on the screen and you press new folder, voila. Call it test two, just so that you guys can see that for yourselves. You go into that folder, it's currently empty. You hold on in a blank area on the screen and you simply press paste. Quick easy and simple. Now, as you can see by simply holding down on the image and then selecting get info once again, it is now in JPEG format. It's the same for this image as well. It's currently in JPEG format. Now, you can do this with any amount of photos as you so desire from your gallery. You could even copy it to another storage device as you may have seen in my other videos where I show you how to copy basically any file from your iPhone to another storage device such as a USB drive, an SD card, an SSD or a standard hard drive. You guys could check that out. I'll leave those links in the description below and at the end of this video. That's about it people. A quick, easy and simple tip that will make your lives a hell of a lot easier in getting your photographs off your iPhone to work on any other device and for you to do any form of editing or post processing later on. So that's about it people. Once again, thanks for tuning in. If you don't know, I'll appreciate a like, subscribe, and of course, hitting that little notification bell so you know when the next video is out. See you in the next one. Peace and take care.